Dive into the heart of the ocean's mystery with Captain Charles Moore as we unravel the enigma of the Great Pacific Garbage Patch. In 1997, a voyage from Hawaii to California led Captain Moore to a startling find, a sea of plastic, not breadcrumbs, hinting at a larger phenomenon. His research revealed a trash vortex created by gyres pulling in plastics and constantly shifting. Media often depict this patch as a solid island, but Moore clarifies, it wasn't a mountain of trash, it was a murky soup. No photo truly captures the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, and it's not the solid mass some imagine. This patch is immense, twice the size of Texas with 79,000 tons of plastic within. Yet, ships sail through without noticing as microplastics, not visible trash islands, make up the majority of this oceanic soup. Unchecked, the patch grows by 2.5% annually posing risks like entanglement and ingestion by marine life. It's part of the plastosphere, where creatures evolve to live amidst our plastic waste, leading to potential biohazards. Efforts like the ocean cleanup led by Boy and Slat aim to clear 90% of the patch by 2040. But experts agree, reducing plastic production is crucial. A hopeful prospect is the International Plastics Treaty, set for negotiation in 2024, aiming to legally bind nations to prevent plastic pollution. As Captain Moore warns, plastic production is going up. The solutions will involve reducing the amount of plastic produced. It's a race against time to save our oceans. Support the cause by liking and subscribing to the international lens for more eye-opening content.